Hello, 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 beautiful people. Welcome back to a brand new Deadman Mode video. And in this video, the plan is simple. Try not to die too much and make as many points as possible. We are obviously trying our best to compete for the top 25 spots in order to secure the max amount of rewards possible in this Deadman Mode. So without further ado, let's jump right into the episode. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, that seems like a, a lot better XP. And then I can do this. Can't right now, here, and then we can do more smithing. All right, we're up to 70 smithing, 43 room crafting. Still just chilling after the breach. Probably gonna go sleep soon, but you know, these are actually profit and good XP. So that's what we're doing first. Good morning. Definitely did not have enough sleep. But the breach is in one minute, so have to wake up, do the breach, and then go back to sleep. That's basically RuneScape nowadays. Uh, yeah, this this breaches uh, definitely mess up with somebody's sleep pattern a bit, but that's okay. As always, gonna go with Mage, see how it goes. First emblem. Mm. We got a trinket. Mm. Another trinket, another emblem. Cool, cool, cool. Hey, emblem. Okay, PK on us. Pick air off us, I think. I just got a Vesta Spear. Okay, well, that's crazy. Pick air on us, get Vesta Spear, and insta TP. Let's bank it, go again. Another emblem, another emblem, another emblem, another emblem, another one. I'm getting a lot. Another emblem. People are not really looting a lot in this world, so I'm getting an absolute feast out of the amount of herbs I'm collecting. Morrigans. Oh, I actually got Morrigan jabs from the global table. That's crazy. Nobody looted them. That's like six mil or something. Dude, this world has so much loot just laying around. So I'm just shoot, loot, shoot, looting. That's it. I'm gonna dip before I get hit. Let me just double check if I got the Morrigans. I did get the Morrigans. Nice. That is actually really good. Uh, that was a pretty decent breach. We're up to 115,000 points. I think we started on 112, so it was probably around 3k. I don't think I checked exactly how many points I had, but we got a Vesa Spear and we got a Morrigans, uh, whatever these are called. Uh, so these are pretty good and obviously Spear is uh, not bad at all. So uh, decent. I'm gonna go back to sleep and I'll be back a bit later. Actually, I think logical thing to do before going back to sleep is to do the farm run. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that first. And that's 85, which means the farming guild is all of a sudden quite safe because I can enter the northern part. So let's go ahead and uh, visit the farming guild as well. And now that we have level 85 farming, I'm also gonna start doing my daily Hesporis. Uh, one is already planted and probably fully grown, so I'm just gonna gear up, look at the tasks, and see if I can get a nice fast kill. Okay, let's go ahead if we can give this a shot. I'm going with Consistency, Feral, and Feral, hoping I get Perma procs. and the task is to kill it in under 36 seconds, I believe. Okay, we got one task. I don't know if I'm fast enough for the fastest one, but I'll try to get a kill with Claws, which is another task. Uh, yeah, not fast enough, not nearly fast enough, so we'll have to do this again, but we should get really good XP here. 126,000, and we get a new seed and the mahogany seed as well, which is good. I'll come back, plant another one, and then I can finally- oh, then I need to do the mahogany trees as well, and then I think I can finally chill. No, these are not grown yet. But I think I can log out here and just wait. Four out of nine. They might actually not be grown yet. I'm still gonna log out here, get some rest, and then uh, we continue when I wake up. <laughs> okay, there's a pick here in the farming guild. That's weird. Just a little 93 herb, and I'm still multi-skilling, so uh, runecrafting is all the way to 50 right now. And we changed the altar, I don't know if I showcased the altar change, but let me show you what that means. So I think per essence, and once again I could be completely wrong, I do believe this altar might be the best. Boom, bam. 
3.5k XP, it's really slow XP, but we get it up basically whilst doing other things. It is time for the farm run. Uh, I'm actually doing this quite often because every time I log out with Sigil of the Nature activated, and I'm pretty sure it works, there's 86. Le we're, we're farming, okay? It's fine. This is actually pretty decent money as well, so making sure I'm connect collecting this coconut because then if, when I do magic trees, I can use those to pay for, uh, for this to not die. Ayo, 87. Just running around doing my magic trees. Okay, bridge starting in now, basically. Uh, Lumbridge Swamp. Okay, so what do we need for this one? Uh, water talisman is nice. And we're just gonna use that as an escape. Oh my god, this guy just dark bombed this guy but died. This might be insta spawn. Holy shit, I got a lot, I think, because... The guy Darug bombed a recoil, so stuff drops on the floor, so I just got his bank, look. I got his super restores, everything. <laughs> that is a movie. I didn't get his Darugs, because I think it just disappears. The fuck? Oh yeah, start is one, 116 points. I'm hoping to get at least a little bit of... I mean, 2k would be nice, but this is complete peak. It's gonna be so hard to get anything. We are basically going to get one hit per mob. There is no way we can get more. Which, again, I will reiterate this in every single breach that I do. I think they are messing up big time by not just giving these mobs more HP. But I, I hope that a uh, little bit of a feedback, if somebody from Jagex watches the videos, or just maybe we'll leave the feedback in the Discord as well, just a little bit more health on these bosses and it would be great. Hey, emblem numero uno. Sigil of the something, well, it disappeared, unlucky. Yeah, just one hit per mob. Hey, we got a little emblem. Okay, we got another emblem. And then we got another one. I mean, all in all, pretty decent breach. Just emblem-wise. Hey, another emblem. Another one. Starting to reach the point where... I don't even know if emblems are worth picking up, because look at my inventory. Like, that is a scary invent inventory to tank with. Another emblem. Okay, another emblem. Now I need to think. I think I'd rather lose a brew than a combo food. That's gonna be it, right? Yeah, it's gone. Loot-wise, good breach. Point-wise, what was this? Like 2,000 and a bit? Uh, we'll take it. Not the best, not the worst. Loot-wise, definitely good. All in all, cannot complain. <laughs> Someone's going crazy with the drop parties here, man. What the fuck's going on? <laughs> Dude, I can't loot shit. Dude, he is going fucking mental. <laughs> ah, this guy is having, uh, he's having fun. I, I respect it, honestly. Hey, would you look at that? Next unlock in one point, which I do believe is then a hard tier, so I could just do something easy. Yo. Yo, what's up, boss? How we doing? You should see my gear, it's fucking crazy. Yo, what, what do you think about <laughs> You are free loot, man. <laughs> I I'm fucking Elva, mate. <laughs> Dude, you're a free loot. Do you have MSB as well? No, I have this. Ah, shit. Now you look like yeah. a snack, man. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you, I might jump you accidentally, like. There's no way, man. Oh, that's funny as fuck. Dude, we look like fucking snack out here. Holy shit, like. <laughs> oi, oi, oi. Okay, so we, we, we send this one first, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is this good points, by the way? Because if this is good points, like, let me tell you. We could sit in multi, see someone turn, kill. Yeah, I'm just gonna check what it's weak to. Okay, it's same in every style. There we go, that's the Hoarder. So one is taking no damage, and one is 25 kills. So we could at least kill it 10 times, but maybe 20... Ah, 25 would be a lot though. We, I think if we just uh, kill it normally, there's a chance I take zero damage. But uh, maybe we worry about tasks after, and we just go check Scorpia, we do like the other tasks. Yeah. That's probably the oh, best no, one. No, I also was hitting like crazy. I just make sure you get one KC. I'll just stop here, okay? I'll let you. I got this KC, I think. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Do you want to go Scorpia? Sure. This is a quick reminder to let you know that you should probably subscribe. I'm ready to freeze, let me tell you. Are we sending it? Anybody in? Yeah, there's a guy here. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Yeah, yeah, I'm on him. Okay, I sent Ice Blitz. So you can go melee if you want. Okay, I'm melee. This guy's a demon. I'm going out. Yeah, I hit the freeze. 
He's going... He's running, come out, come out. I got the freeze outside. I'm almost killing him. I'm step undering, so... Hey, let's yeah, get it, dude. Yeah, <laughs> he said... That's the first one. Oh my god, wait, that's a lot of loot. I got Uncharged Trident, Black Mask. What the fuck? Wait, why is this guy risking so much? I got like two bankies. Okay, we're tanking this one out, by the way. No, we're, sh we're sending one Scorpio a kill. Yeah, yeah, we but like... Them. I got so much loot, brother, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, I got 5 million in just full rune drops. This guy was not playing. Come loot the rest, by the way. I can't even loot everything this guy was risking. Yeah, but. Oh, oh there, no, this is team, team logging, team logging, team logging outside. Really? Yeah, yeah, run, 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 run. I saw at least four people. I saw at least four logging in. This guy has protectors. Really? Yes, I promise you. Or they were running oh. to do something else. Saw them but, on the uh, minimap. Where, where did you run? I just ran to singles. I'm gonna. Oh. Are they on you? Yeah, that's... No, that's probably this... But, but how... Where I'm safe, I'm them? safe. They were south. They were south on the Chaos Elemental. At least three people. Probably maybe hitting multi or something. But yeah, I am sitting on a black mask and five million in the looting bag with Corrupted Shadow, Corrupted Void Waker and uh, actually a lot of stuff. This guy had like a full PK on him. He must have protectors. Like, there is no way we kill him and then instantly there's people outside, right? Yeah. There is no but way. He had he had a key though, so maybe he killed someone and they came to revenge. You know? Maybe <laughs> that's actually funny though. Because if I die to someone and I know they are like doing Scorpia and I die to Scorpia or they PK me, I will gear up and I will bring my friends. You know. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny as fuck. I am uh, two minutes off. Okay, well, how, I'm gonna run how... to edge. Come, come, come. I, it's one minute left on the key, so we just run you, back here. You run all the way to edge. We go through ice. We go through the ice part, don't we? Okay, fine, I'll follow you. No, I meant like just to the web because it's one minute. But if we get jumped oh, now, oh, it's like... Oh, the, the edge. I thought you meant we go to edge. You know? No, 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 like to the leader. Uh, yeah, okay. First keys of the deadman mode. Here we go. Four million. It's good really? though. Crush nests, snapdragons, three dragon holly, 3000 ref runes, 50 brews. It's actually not bad. It supplies. And then one mil of the guy he killed for a bunch of topaz, ranging pots, runes, expeditions yeah, bracelets. That's actually good loot, the fuck? Not, not bad, not bad. It's actually yeah, not I was, bad. Uh, like three man picking earlier, right? Right. And we teleport to um, to the corp cave. Oh shit. And I enter, I enter, I see five people stacked on top of each other. We are three people, okay? <laughs> okay. I run in, I say they're all clumped, so I barrage them. And they're like, hell nah, and they all run. And like, both of my uh, my guys, they just run away. And I'm like, 1v5 there. And I just die for like, serial stuff, so. Oh shit, I'm there's like, no way they let you die. Like, the, yeah, the they fuck? Just, they just up. run in. They, they just run in and they say, hell nah, and they run back out. And oh, I am schooled, so I don't, I don't know where to go. Yeah, that's messed up. Okay, let's go, let's go. Tell me if someone's inside. What do you even pray on this boss? Range. Anyone in? No, this is free sand. Maybe we do the diary as well to kill like one Scorpia, one whatever. There we go. Oh, Scorpia damaged you, so we failed the task. That's unlucky, but whatever. So for every elite, every elite task you do in achievement diary, you get sixty-four points. Wait, what? Yeah. That is wait. I should do all of those then. What the fuck? Yeah, you should do all achievement diaries because when you finish it, you get like XP lamp as well, right? Yeah, but you see a bonus reward of half of the total points the tier is worth. So if the tier is worth like, if there's 10 elite tasks, you get Yeah, let me fuck or... this guy up real quick. I mean, I've done like 10 kills in a row of this guy. That's also a combat task. But it's so weird because you have achievement task, combat task, like so many things. Oh, there's a here. Really? Yeah, yeah. Do you want to jump him? Yeah, but we are not in multi. Yeah, we, we I kite to multi. Like, I'm running. He's going to go for me. Just... Uh... Yeah, but oh. the multi is... To it's the up right here. It's up here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's fine, I'll bait him in. He probably doesn't have multi lines. Oh, he has Veng. Yeah. He has the staff as well. Maybe he has a team. Maybe we get fucked up. Nah, we send it to multi. There's nothing you can do. He's in multi now, go. Oh, I, uh. That's good, that's good. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Do you have uh, claws? Go, go, go. Go with claws. Yeah. Oh, he has team uh... though. Shit. Oh. Ooh. No. 
I'll be fine if you freeze. Yeah, I'm trying. They're both oh, with they're BLS. They're frozen, they're frozen. I'm dead, I oh, think. Fuck. Good luck. Try to freeze the guy on me if you can with single. I'll run it into singles here, I think. Wow, what a hit. Wow. 44 33. That's uh, crazy. Yeah, I'm, I'm dead now. <laughs> well, that didn't last very long, did it? Wow, I just got. Oh, there's another one as well. This is there is, Yeah, they are they are holding the fucking uh, KBD, by the way. This, I think this is the same guy I tanked down to Narnia. Well, that was. That didn't work out, did it? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. It didn't. It's fine, I buy another void, we go again. Okay, well, <laughs> that uh, that didn't end very nicely, but it's okay, cause look guys, we can do, we, we can we can train some Herbler again. We love Herbler, let's go, look, boom, potions, yes. Okay, so I just did a little bit of skilling, because if I were to die again, I don't want to lose the supplies that I deem important for skilling, right? So I don't want to lose my Snapdragons, for example. If I lose Bruise, fine, I have a million points. I lose Prayer Potions, fine, I have a million points. I lose 300, 300, 300k, don't care about it. Defense Potions, don't mind Super Restores. These are a bit a lot, so I'm probably gonna actually grab my Restores and make them tier four and actually sell them. Okay, now that is the key. I don't necessarily mind losing. Still, it will cost me back maybe a mil, maybe two, but all in all, chilling. I will be doing something that I actually did not know that I could do, and that is diaries. Oh my goodness, would you look at how many diaries we can complete? And I need to do as many as I possibly can because they give points. And I'm not gonna start with easies. I'm going straight for elite tasks because they give the most amount of points. Uh, but first, there's another thing that I haven't done and that is uh, do this and go here. Uh, because I have also, with all this bossing that we've been doing lately, uh, I also can claim another reward from Gomal. And I think this is going to be the hard tier with infinite amount of teleports to Trollheim. So that should now give me tier three rewards, which is perfect with an XP lamp, which we can now use on rune crafting i believe this is the slowest skill for me 150,000 xp going from 52 straight to 60 which is huge and now we begin the grind to do some diaries okay so i figured since i am going to be going for a rusty sword which is a part of some diaries that i plan on doing i'm just gonna start with rd diaries and then work my way around i wanted to start with the leads but there's so much to do so i might as well start at the beginning uh, but i figured you know what we might as well grab the relics which allow me to stack the clues so fortune farmer sigil of the treasure hunter and then bloodhound is not really needed but i have it and just go on and steal a bunch of stuff and see if i can stack up some clues Oh, well, I found Rusty Sword of the Bat, so I'm not gonna be here for too long. Okay, let's start with the tasks. That's the first one. That's the Silk Sold to Silk Merchant. That is entering the combat camp. Okay, so give sword to this guy. That's a task. And now the question is, can I start this by myself? Yeah, one minute. Okay, so I can start this by myself. That's good. And that just does it automatically. And that was it. That's the last easy task. Let's see if we can finish the mediums as well. Okay, so that should be 481. So that should give points, no? Yeah. See how many points that was? That was ridiculous amount of points. Uh, so I'm just gonna do the high level ones because the lower ones I need to do a bunch of quests. And I'm not in the mood to do quests right now. So I'm just gonna try to do elite tasks. So let me see if this works. So how many points is this? Five four five. I make a skill caper mode. Five four five. So it's like sixty points or something. Yeah, sixty four points, which I think it's worth doing the easy ones, like the ones that are simple to do. One hundred percent. Okay, so from here, I'm pretty sure I just need to. Let me double check this. Three magic. Yeah. So I need ninety one farming, which I have. I have ninety three. I can check this. Now I actually need to manually chop it down and then look for roots. Hope it works with a boost. And if it doesn't, we'll just do this again when in two more levels. So there we go. We chopped it. Let's take a look. Will it work? So I got 15, but it did not count towards my diary. See, I think, I think 15 is more than three, but I think the game cannot recognize the fact that they went directly to my bank. 
So we'll have to do this again without the sigils equipped, which uh, probably just a little oversight uh, from the developers. It is what it is. Okay, I've been procrastinating this for a while, but it is time to get at least 75 agility. So I can do a little lap on Releka agility course because that's points and I want to get agility up to at least 90 this deadman mode anyways. So let's get jumping. So here it is. The 75 agility is now done. And now with the sigil of exaggeration, which I have equipped, I can now do Releka course and that's basically the diary. So always pray melee before exiting to not get double clawed and let's do one quick lap. Okay, so if I trade Grace, I should be able to buy Amelie back and I could use this to make Staminas and Staminas are good money. So there we go, good XP, but most importantly, really, really good money. You can buy this for 1k and sell this for 10k. Welcome to Deadman mode, where we are DCing yet again. Similar time. That is pretty bad. Like, that is very bad. Luckily, we were not in danger, but that's the second day in a row of just DCing at uh, evening. All right, we're sending a little late night bando strip. Let's get it. So there's still two bosses we haven't done. One is Bandos, one is Ziliana. Oh, I got a frozen piece of a minion. I didn't even know that was possible. Hey, we got a little kill. Nice, and a little achievement as well. Okay, so he got the achievement, I didn't. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Yeah, I got it, nice. Okay, so now only thing from Bandos is to get 100 KC. Oh, but so XD, bro. So I'm trading in the mole parts and I didn't realize how many seeds you get with this thing. What in the hell? Uh, guys, is this normal or? I only killed 100 mole. Oh, wait, mahogany is good. That's like 50k. Five mahoganies is pretty good. Hey, look at that. I'm selling willow seeds for... Really good money. Maple seeds apparently 100k. Like what? Who's paying these prices? I'll take it. Acorn 7k. Okay, ladies, gentlemen, breach. This is a once again 4 a.m. breach, okay? So I'm not gonna be speaking loud to not wake people up. And it's starting in a minute and I need points and I need as many points as possible because when I go KBD, I die. I go DKs, I die. I try to do somewhere else, I die. Basically, the problem is everywhere you go, you end up dying uh, because clans take care of everything. Oh yeah, start of the points, 120,000 and a little bit because I already got some points. So let's just say we started at 120,000. I'm also praying melee permanently to not get double claw rushed and I always brew up over 99 HP. It's the only real way to prevent getting one hit here these days. It's, uh, it's rough out here. That's the first emblem. We'll try our best to get as many of those as possible. Oh, Morrigan throwing eggs. That's so much money, by the way. That's one of the best drops you can get. That's almost equal to VLS in, uh, in money situation. Huge. Okay, we got an emblem. I would love to get Criara KC, but I don't know how to even get it. It's so hard. Because I have 12 left on the task, and it would get me to 99 Slayer. A, an emblem. So I get XP for that, but I didn't even hit it. How does that make any sense? Another emblem, going. Another emblem. We'll take one more. There's so much loot, but we are completely full. One, two, three. So I think we got 3000 points or close to, which I am happy with. That is what we have to take in singles. That's pretty solid. Now it's 4 a.m. Most people would go sleep, but this is unfortunately the only time where I can probably get some points. So we'll see if we die again. A mud battle stuff. It sells for a bit, so we'll take it. 
Also, if you quickly take a look in the chat, 71 KC of Supreme, 68 of Rex, 52 of Prime. The goal is to get all of those above 100. And in an ideal world, we don't instantly get killed. But that is literally the only way uh, you can get somewhat decent points in this deadman mode. Every single boss is camped by a clan. Every single boss is multi. So we'll see how long we survive here for. Hey, archers in. Nice. I think that's the worst one out of the three, but it still sells for like 2 million, 1 million. Ah, it's still 2 million, that's uh, pretty good. Every time we get a drop, we'll take it to safety. Oh, another archer's ring, nice. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. That's worth like 3 mil. Never mind, apparently it's 2 million now, but still, really nice drop. <laughs> Is that a third archer's ring, I think? That's crazy. Oh, oh, that's money. Sigil of Enhanced Harvest. That is definitely money. Let's dip. That is uh, really good. That's five times resources when harvesting. If you guys do not know, all the money we make through PVMing is going towards the final hour gear. So we still need to afford Mazori body, uh, Ring of Suffering, uh, DFS, stuff like that. Uh, this is probably the longest I've gone in multi without dying, and I'm almost at 100 KC. I probably just jinxed myself, but sometimes it's good to be grateful to be able to kill bosses in a 2007 version of an online game at 6 a.m. Dragon X on KC 99. There it is, we did it, 100 kill count. Now I just need the other two to catch up. The reason why this one is always higher than others is because when you enter the room, you always kill that guy first. Rex is very close by and Prime is just struggling behind. Happy to have one on 100 KC. The problem now is I'm not gonna get 10 points for him, I'm only gonna get five. <laughs> why are they directly under each other? I can't fucking see what to flick, man. Oh, yes! Nice. Sears Ring is a lot of money right now. That's really good. Yes, Berserker Ring. Nice. 8 million right now. 7 to 8. Let's get out of here. And we also got our Rex kill count over 100. So now just Prime. Uh, once I reach all three bosses to 100, we're gonna move on to bigger and better things. But for now, we try to make as much money as possible before we leave this place forever. Boss. Oh, no, 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 oh, not again. There is no shot. I died to AC again, bro. Ah, this is so sad, by the way. I literally cannot play the game. It's so depressing. It's so depressing because the way they made the points, you have to kill the bosses. And you cannot fucking kill the bosses because every boss that gives points is in multi. And everywhere you go, you just get hunted by the same fucking clan. Is the most annoying thing ever. Ah, oh, it's so fucking frustrating at this point. Like, I don't know, man. I don't even know why I bothered.